Welcome to Dashway Talks, a show powered by Dashway Consulting, a China-based strategic market research company founded in 2010. With Dashway Talks, you will stay up to date with all the latest business updates in China. Every day, you will learn from China-based experts who share their knowledge about the Chinese market in two to five minutes. Hello, everyone. My name is Miro. I'm the founder of Double V Consulting, an agency that helps overseas brands to enter China, and China Bowl Academy, an online training and resources sharing platform that focusing on China marketing. Bootsy beauty brands are the most successful and popular in China. I think when you say most successful, uh, it's definitely perfect diary. Uh, is the most successful C beauty brands now in China. Even compared to foreign brands, it's also very successful when you are talking about the popularity, the sales, uh, everything. And uh, there are also some other emerging brands are getting more and more uh, popular. For example, uh, makeup brands, we see that uh, Florisis, the Chinese name is Hua Xizi, and Gerkot, and Color Key, uh, Judy Dog. This is these are also very successful and popular makeup brands. And in terms of skincare, we see uh, Home Facial Pro, we know that Chando, Proya. These are also very popular uh, now in China. We are plugged in to the local business landscape together with China-based entrepreneurs and top managers. Follow our China Paradigms podcast on any platform convenient for you. Find the links in the description. What are some of the relatively new but very trendy sea beauty brands? First, uh, skincare in the skincare category, we see that uh, PMPM, uh, a brand called PMPM, is uh, recently getting more and more uh, uh, popular. It's um, I think the whole concept of the brand is pretty similar to a niche uh, American brand. Uh, drunk elephant. Uh, the whole concept of the ingredients, the function, everything. Um, and we also see another skincare brand called Sim Care. Simu Yuan is also becoming very trendy now. And in terms of the cosmetics category, we see Yu Kiss, Flower Nose, Hua Zhixiao, and Kaleidos, Wan Hua Jing. And another more trendy brand is from the men care category because we know that uh, Chinese uh, male uh, customers, especially young uh, male customers, are also um, care about their skincare more and more. So we see an emerging men care uh, brand called Make Essence Li Ran is also getting more popular now on Xiaohongshu. Any questions? We will find an expert to answer them. Drop your questions in the comments or send us an email, dx at dashwayconsulting.com.